What's going on guys? In today's video tutorial we're going to be updating item slow to 1.06 I believe it is and we're going to also be updating ETA hen to I think it's 1.62 um, lol okay so first things first let's turn on the system okay after you turn on the system you want to go ahead and download my pack so let's go on the computer okay just um, drag and drop my pack onto here that's the newest version of item slow I'll meet you back on the PlayStation 5. Okay, now that we're on the PS5, what you wanna do is you wanna to connect to the internet. So, first things first, you just wanna go into settings. Then you wanna go into network. Then you wanna go over here to settings. You wanna turn on the internet. Go back, make sure that you are connected. I'll be right back. Okay, you can see that we're connected to the internet now. Um, this is actually second time making this video guide. So first things first, what you want to do is you want to go ahead and if you're using the Idle Sauces offline host, you want to go ahead and you're going to run this. Okay. Now, if you're on an older ETA head, you're probably going to be on version 1.2 to 1.4. The latest version is 1.6. Now, what you want to do is you want to go ahead and you want to, I'm going to go through it with you guys. You want to go ahead and you want to open it up for the first, for the second time or whatever. Okay. Then you want to go ahead and click on jailbreak. Now what's going to happen is if you're on an older version of what's going to happen is if you're on an older version of like let's say 1.2 or 1.4 and now we're going to be updating to 1.6, what's going to happen is it's going to download the cache from Idle Sauces host and it's going to update your uh, Idle Sauces host offline. So basically you're going to connect to the internet now it's going to download the update to your Idle Sauces host offline after it updates and uh, you're all set ready to go. So basically for the first time you need to jailbreak the system through this application, connect to the internet so it can download all the information you need to store off the offline host. So basically it's going to download the, the information and it's going to be transferred into your offline host. So after that's done, it will say, let's say version 1.4, you're going to press jailbreak and jailbreak the system, then turn off the system, turn back on the system, then you'll be on the latest version of Idle Sauce's host, which is 1.6. So I'll be back in a second. Okay, I crashed normally as what it does. So when you're connected to the internet, like I was talking about before, as you can see on the bottom left hand side, it says version 1.6 beta. Of lightning mods now if you're on an older if you're on a older cache version it will say 1.2 or 1.4 or whatever as you can see I'm on the latest version you're not going to be on the latest version if you're watching this video so you just want to go ahead and you want to run the uh, jailbreak and it will jailbreak the system then you want to go ahead and turn off the system and turn it back on so let's go ahead and do that Okay, the system is jailbroken now, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and uh, restart the system. So let's go ahead and restart the system. Okay, now that we restarted the system from the old version of ETA Hen, let's go ahead and let's go ahead turn. Make sure you turn off the internet. The internet's turned off. Let's go ahead and run, and run the Idle Sauce host. I'll be back when this is done. Okay, as you can see, we're not on. We're not on 1.2 or 1.4, we're on 1.6. Don't worry about that, sometimes that happens. Okay, as I was saying before, you're going to be either on 1.2 or 1.4, but now that you restart the system after the jailbroken process and it downloaded the cache off the internet. Okay, you can see we're on the latest version, 1.6, so go ahead and jailbreak the system. I'll be back when that's done. Okay, what you do is put your flash drive into your system. We're going to go into settings. We're going to go all the way to the bottom of debug. Game. Press OK. Package installer. I already installed this, so go ahead and press install. It's going to ask you, do you want to override? Press yes. Okay, after that's all done, you want to open up the item slow. Okay, now that we installed item slow, let's go ahead and open it up. Press update later you happen I had to connect back on the internet I had a problem with something okay as you can see item slow is loading so let's go ahead and let's uh, test an application make sure it works 
I'll be back when that's loaded. Okay, as you can see, it is loaded and it is working. Anyway, guys, that's it for the video guide. Like and subscribe to the Fox Den. I'm not going to really go over any new features with item slow because I'm kind of tired. I just want to relax for the rest of the day. I just wanted to make this update guide for you to see what's going on. Basically, with the item slow update, it now supports version 4.02 of the firmware. And there's like some shortcut keys you can do some shortcut stuff with and do some other stuff. But anyway, guys, I'll catch you next time. Like and subscribe to Fox Den.